I know a lot of times, you know, we talk about turtles and stuff, but I don't think we ever actually get into the details of it. Like, uh, the shell or the anatomy. This is a Herman's tortoise. So the top of the shell is called the pla or the carapace. At the bottom is called the plastron. Each one of these little squares here are called the scutes, and I'm going to get into more detail, but these are kind of hard to make out, so I'm going to get a tortoise that's a little bit easier to make them out where you can see because all these kind of run together, and our best bet would be to use a Russian tortoise. So here is the Russian tortoises. Here's number one. We'll grab number one, and I mark these just so they're a little bit easier for me to identify just by looking at. So each one of these, easier to see this way. This right here would be a male. Look how long that tail is. So we'll take a look at him. And we're gonna learn straight from a textbook, Herpetology, third edition. All right, if we can get this Russian tortoise to be still, All right, so let's take a look here. So we're looking at the carapace, which is the top of the shell here. The bottom we'll get into later. The bottom is called the plastron. All right, so the nuchal scute, which is right here. Now these are right there, it looks like, your nuchal scute, okay? Your vertebral scutes are the ones that go straight down the middle. So these right here would be your vertebral scutes. Now we're looking at the, it looks like costal scutes, coastal scutes. These are gonna be the ones that run down the side. Costal scutes. Okay, and then your marginal scutes are gonna be these. So over here on the side, these right here will be your marginals. And you got your supra caudal skew, which would be this one here, just above the tail. Okay, now up underneath, up underneath the uh, scutes here is the actual bone. So on the left side, it shows the bones that is layered up underneath each scute. All right, so let's take a look at the bones. So this right here would be the, be still. This right here would be the nuchal bone. Be still. All right, and then we have our neural bones that run through here, and then your pleural bones that run through here. Pleural bones. Be still. Then your peripheral bones over here on the side. Okay, and then your suprapygial bones, which would be these. And then your pygeal bone back here in the back. Pygeal bone. Okay, so if you was to peel these scutes off, you would actually see the bone. But, you know, these aren't made to come off. If you're interested in learning more about these guys or any other type of reptile, I highly recommend you buy this book off of Amazon. I mean, it was kind of pricey. I think it was like 60 bucks. But it's better than any of those reptile books you'll find at like PetSmart, Petco. It goes into a lot of detail.